Yeah. It's your girl Shawty, and we um coming to you again with another dope creator. Appreciate that. Like that's the best word to use because sometimes I don't even know what to label it. All right, all right. <laughs> she gonna be poetic Jane today. <laughs> <laughs> already know and if you're looking for some merch like this just head over to the website you already know cheapest.com look she learned that shit already <laughs> damn i forgot the most important part jane spelled j-a-y-n-e okay. right. you're gonna have to do a pop quiz at the end of this because they ain't got it you <laughs> ain't got that shit that shit Woo -woo. i know you say you got a, a tape coming out this summer yeah i want to i honestly want to drop it on my birthday june 28th um, so hopefully I can have it done by then. Um, but yeah, I'm working on a project that's going to be about six to eight songs. And it's really going to be a visual, more so a visual project. Um, each video or visual is going to play into the net. And I don't want to say too much about it, but it's going to be more so, more so of a story. So I'm starting to shoot. I got the concept down for... Uh, not all the videos, but I definitely got the concept. Like I said, it's gonna be a, a, a more so a, a movie, so I got to take more time in all the concepts of the videos and make sure they all link up. Okay. So you heard it on Chief of Jane Doe. She, <laughs> said, she said, you gonna have to wait. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like there's two types of artists. I feel like there's single artists, which like I feel like they drop hella singles, like they produce mass singles. Mm -hmm and just knowing one gonna hit, you know what I'm saying? Okay. And then I feel like there's artists that, they might not drop something for a whole year, like two years, they'll drop something and wait like a year, another year. But everything they put into that one project, mm -hmm. it's like, I'm putting everything into this, so it's not, the, the, the wait is worth it. Right, okay. so. I'm just not ready to be shooting mad stuff out there because I want everything that I put out, I want to look back on it and say, like, I really took my time with that. My first EP is more so of a story. It's kind of nerve-wracking, honestly. Why? Because it's so much work. Yeah, it's so much work and that I'm trying to do in a short amount of time, but I feel like if I don't do it like that, I'm never going to do it. Because I've been writing music, I've been doing music, uh, I didn't have songs, but I never put no pressure on myself to do anything with it. So you never took it serious. Yeah, I never took it serious. At least not getting it out. The people are really mm -hmm. coming to age up as an artist and owning that. So you're hearing it now. Cherokee Jane got that flame on the way this summer. <laughs> I got the Cherokee Either Jane. way, this summer Jane got the flame on the way. Because they be mistaking me for the one chick on Pornhub. Her name Cherokee mm -hmm. Jane. So we're just a multimedia hub. We cover two main areas. That's music. That's primary. The music and then media. Okay. So like for example, the website. We, we um, of course, sell our merch. Um, and that's when we're getting into the like the uh, merchant side of things, which is coming later. But the website, you can see uh, productions that we're working on. You can see music from our artists um, that we um, artists that we push our own music ourselves, but also the artists that we push. Um, but you'll hear a lot more about this summer. We're actually doing something with um, it's a youth event for a church in Atlanta and they're coming down, it's called Unity Day. And basically what they do is is to minister to like children, but let them know like um, different ways to get into um, finances, um, career, like career building and career searching and just really, um, really showing kids how to get out and network and, and start early or at least get the, the uh, conversation rolling or the thoughts and ideas in their head. Right. Because the things that I'm doing now, if I would have started thinking about it when I was 12 or 13, I probably would, 
what no, this happened. Yeah, this would have already happened by now. You feel me? That's a free event. Free event, and it's for the kids. So bring your kids out. It's gonna be free food. No age limit. It's no. Everybody is welcome, but it is a family, family friendly event. Family <laughs> friendly. <laughs> I just gotta put that out there. Christians will be there. 